opposite. Gotta represent. Chase a chick. Never chase a bitch. Fuck it, mask up. Percocet. Miley Percocet. Chase a chick. Never chase a bitch. Chase no bitch. Two cups. Toast up with the game. From full stops to a whole nother domain. Got it. I'm a living proof, so they compromise. You work for others, you are at their mercy. They own your work, they own you. Your creative spirit is squashed. What keeps you in such positions is a fear of having to sink or swim on your own. Instead, you should have a greater fear of what will happen to you if you remain dependent on others for power. Your goal in every maneuver in life must be ownership. Work in the corner for yourself. When it's yours, it's yours to lose. You're more motivated, more creative, more alive. The ultimate power in life is to be completely self-reliant, completely yourself. When you What's up? This is Lucky Loco with the Lucky Loco Show. Go ahead and hit that like, hit that like subscribe. Uh, today I'm going to get into, I've decided enough's enough. Um, restaurant, no location, it's just, I'm, you know, I'm going through the whole struggle, so, you know, my business loan didn't go through, so it doesn't look like I'm going to be in California next year or anywhere and anytime soon. Um, I'm praying that this uh, entrepreneurship class that I just uh, finished up, um, they're helping me build with an accountant, with um, with quite a few other things, man. Uh, I'm definitely going to be going to, um, I'm not giving up. I'm just giving up on the restaurant. I'm giving up on the location. It's uh, I'm not in debt, so I don't owe anybody money. I'm just washing my hands and walking away. And it is, it, it's not a bad thing. You know, uh, there's support in the Yakima area to where they're not charging me overhead, that they want to see me move. They want to see me thrive. So I'm just going to go ahead and go back to the food trailer and handle my business and definitely keep the uh, A&B movement going. Um, it's my baby. Uh, and she said, I put my baby in a bad location and that I will be going to other places to get to where I need to be, you know, backpedaling, whatever, you know, um, it's not a failure to me. It's, um, it's a little bit heartbreaking. I ain't going to lie. I'm not going to act like, uh, you know, everybody that builds up, uh, Builds up the foundation of where we're going. Um, I seen somebody in the comment call me. Said that uh, I'm a waste. Some dude, uh, ten toes, said that I'm that I'm washed up. And I don't believe so, man. You know, I'm out here making it happen. I just show my face. My uh, it's public information where I'm at, and I'm always gonna be out here. I'm gonna be out in your neighborhood. Gonna be out in everywhere else. I can. That's the thing about me is that I can go places. I don't hide. Uh, I'm out here publicly doing it. And most people don't want to face their fears, and which I did is face my fears, and I learned. You know, I got knocked down quite a few times, and I got right back up and went and did it again. You know, they say that's insanity, but you know what? And to reach your goals, to get where you're at, you know, this is, to me, it's mentally healthy. It's, um, it's something that I do cherish, and I wish that it flourished the way it was supposed to flourish, but, you know... Certain things happen, you get haters, you get uh, loss of the support from the community for some reason or the other, or some people just feel some type of way or jealous about like the accomplishments that you're doing, that they, they feel that you do not deserve where you're at. But, you know, I don't let that type of stuff get to me. I got, you know, for the few people that do act that way towards me, I got thousands of other supporters that cheer me on. So I'm not going to stay focused on the bad person that's sitting there waving their fist with jealousy or envy or hiding behind uh, a name. You know, uh, my, you know, I have posts where my locations are at all the time. I'm out here being a businessman. I'm not a gangster. I'm not whatever. And I take pride in that. I am happy about it, you know. For somebody to say that I don't support other channels, I don't have time to get on other people's channels and even watch. People see me, I'm hardly ever in the chats, but, you know, it is what it is. And, you know, a &B Native American Cuisine is going to be in Union Gap, back in the trailer, you know. But, you know, if that's where I got to go with no overhead, with more support in a, in, a, in a certain area, like in Yakima, why not? You know, go go through some hardships. Go to where you need to be. No overhead? I mean, come on, man. 
that's beautiful. I mean, the support I get from the the owner of the property and the business where I'm going to be at is beautiful, man. Who could ask for a blessing like that? You know, some people just roll it up, check in, and go fucking hide and and don't want to show their face. Not me, man. You know, I'll walk around with a black eye, missing tooth. You know, I have got beat up, but I got back up. I'm not hiding. I'm not, uh, you know, hiding behind the faults or be, uh, the failure that some people like to call it. And I'm not. I am an entrepreneur. I refuse to give up the power that I have to make things happen. I'm not giving in to the negative comments. I'm not giving in to people's negative judgments. I am a warrior of my people in the face of a company. And hopefully I inspire some people to get out and do it, man. Because that's the whole main thing of this whole, you know, somebody who comes from prison, ex-gang member, ex-drug dealer, you know, um, you get to move on with life. I'm no longer that. I'm no longer held as a person who's going to be in that light anymore. I'm not that person I was growing up. You know, people grow, people mentally grow, people change, and people do things for the better. And I'm definitely somebody who's learned my lesson, who's definitely going forward, and who appreciates a good struggle, a good fight. A good, you know, if it was handed to me easy, hey, that'd be cool too, man. You know, if somebody believed in me and gave me that um, that loan, that would have been nice. But you know what? I got to go do it myself. And nobody can take that from me. So I'm building up everything. I'm going in for a, a different loan with a different company. to see who believes in the, in the movement. And if not, hey, I got to go do it myself, man. And I am completely fine with that. I am so, you know, it's uh, it's Lucky Loco, man. I really appreciate your time. I really appreciate the support. You know, I'm over 300 uh, subscribers now. And it's uh, this is a journey. And you're going to be following along. You're going to see me heading back to the food, uh, the food trailer tomorrow. I'm going to be out here feeding the homeless here Christmas Eve. All by myself. You know, this is certain stuff, you know. A lot of people donated to it, and, you know, a lot, it's just a social experiment to see who really cared and who really wanted to donate. Well, Lucky Loco, you have yourself a great day, man. Hit that like and subscribe.